How's it going, everyone? Teacher talking sports. Week 9 is now in the books after the Steelers' 29-27 victory over the Chicago Bears. So if you are still alive in your survivor pool, congratulations. Um, anything can happen in football any given Sunday, as we saw um, with the Jaguars beating the Bills 9-6 to in Week 9. So it's not easy to last nine weeks. Um, this week is an 18-week season, 17 games per team. So uh, we're officially halfway through. Now, I am one of those lucky people who have made it through. This week, um, this past week, I took the Colts. I got lucky. That was a Thursday night game. Mike White got hurt. And so once the Colts won, I could relax knowing I had moved on. Uh, prior weeks, week eight, I took the Chiefs over the Giants. Week seven, Cardinals over the Texans. Week six, Rams over the Giants. Week five, Ravens over the Colts. Week four, Bills over the Texans. Week three, Broncos over the Jets. Week two, Browns over the Texans. And week one, 49ers over the Lions. So um, if you remember that week five game, I got extremely lucky. That was the Monday night game when um, the Ravens were down, I think, 19 in the third quarter and came back to win in overtime. But, hey, sometimes that happens to stay alive in Survivor. So let's take a quick look at Week 10 and who are the best teams to take this week for Survivor. Um, Thursday night game, I'm sure some people will be taking the Ravens. I've already taken them. Um, let's see if Tua plays. Uh, my best bet. Um, the team I would take if I could take any team this week would definitely be the Buffalo Bills. I just do not envision them losing two straight games to inferior opponents. Um, I think they're going to be pumped to play. They're going to you know, put up their A effort against a Jets team. Even though Mike White is expected to be back, um, I definitely expect the Bills to win by multiple scores. They would be my best bet to take in Survivor. Unfortunately, I have taken them. Uh, so the teams I'm looking at right now are the Buccaneers at the Washington football team. What worries me a little bit is Ryan Fitzpatrick possibly being a, um, available to come off the IR and play in that game. Uh, I've seen Fitzmagic a lot in my life, so um, that worries me a bit. Uh, other games I am looking at are the Lions at the Steelers. In the back of my mind, though, it's like, are the Lions due for a win? I don't see them going 0-17. Uh, they've hung tough in a couple of games. Uh, Steelers haven't exactly looked great. They didn't look great last night, blowing um, a 14-point lead. But is there a possibility? And then if you have the Cardinals available, I'm sure some people will be looking to take them, especially if Kyler Murray and uh, DeAndre Hopkins are back. I was thinking about the Packers until it was announced that Russell Wilson was cleared to play. So it looks like Russell Wilson will be back for the Seattle Seahawks. Um, Packers um, should have Aaron Rodgers back, but that's not a given yet. So uh, that's a game I really can't take. And if you still have the Rams available, I'm sure you'll be looking at potentially taking them after the 49ers dud against the Cardinals team that did not have Kyler Murray or DeAndre Hopkins, had Colt McCoy starting, and they still uh, weren't close to defeating the Cardinals. So if you have the Bills available, I think that's definitely the best team you can take. Since I don't have the Bills available, I'm thinking either the Buccaneers or the Steelers, and I'm leaning towards the Buccaneers. Um, again, if Fitzpatrick does play, he worries me a little bit because, um, you know, he has those occasional games where he goes off the charts. Uh, Washington's pass rush hasn't fully uh, reached its full potential this season, uh, but the Bucks do have a good offensive line. So right now, um, I don't see the Bucks losing two in a row, um, especially coming off a bye. So that's probably who I'm going to take. But if you're still alive in your week 10 survivor who are you looking to take let me know in the comments have a great tuesday